for this nation, which is very bad, all over the media. This one is saying that these are changing the realm. These are changing the realm. These are changing the realm. Hey, hey, Ghanaians, be wise enough. God is not a rumor. Be, be smart enough. We men of God all over, this one said things are changing the realm. Things are changing the realm. No, we are no longer kids for you people to be deceiving us. This change in the realm. If somebody said this one is on top, tomorrow this, this is a lie. It's a big lie. A servant can never be greater than his master. That's the word of God. So don't deceive us. Don't deceive us. This time is not your time. Baunya, go back to the drawing board. Your, your master couldn't drive us. And then God said, no. Mahama is coming to lead us. Remember, we are not talking about family. We are talking about nation. We are talking about nation. What do we think we are doing? Please and please, you can joke with your life. Don't joke with the nation. You and I will live. The Ghana is still a Ghana. Behave as a prophet. Behave as a prophet of nation. Behave as a prophet of nation. But what I'll tell you, this is what I saw. Yeah, Mahama, God has already chosen him. God has already chosen him. It's clear there. Abu Sinafuwa metiyeche obi biyara. Akwalanya me. Ena mwensa kani se siya ya yi. Mala ma kwa lanya mina wuti ni dino. Mina mwensa kami se siya ano. Mina mida pang soba. Spiritual and herbal center ano. Ya rie biya. E unkono. Anase wwe chinya 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 abre. Bibiti se apatitis. Bibiti se stroke. Stroke diye. E boni pa kura tuto form na wenti min kasa kura na masha wu 3 days. Masu ya ye uba minjisika. Tiye miye. Masu ya ye uba minjisika. Na mino uba kwa apam unhu towa. Ase debi wakwa na wadi yaba. Be ma diye, a diye be cheno, e se se wa yi ni sori jina hon mu street. E me se ubi a ti ma se. Na sa diye nan sori an jine street diya, na ye problem. E nu ane se uwa US o uwa UK o ba biya uwa biya no. O ba fami nomba. E nu ne gua se, anu na wo diya fremi. Ana se o ba ba ma su ye ye. Wutu u kwa yi, se u kwa kwa pe bi bi diya ba fi ye. O kwa ye krata se ma juma se ma. Tire se u na u da kura na u sun sum da ye basa basa basa. E nu ane se u ba fa pang soba. Nomba no, na wa freme, u freme insu a wensabe kame. Me kansi subi yo, uba masue ya, me njisika. E nuwa nise mene ube kwa pam, unhuto wa na wodi asida edi ya ba. A uwa sem, a uwa sem, uwa ube timanya sika wa ubotom. Ne mwa mwa, a uwa ntino, wa mba te ite wosa ama u unu babi ya ubesi. Ude di ebe yane se, freme, anase bre masue ya, ne yentira wose, ya di ahahain, ene esa yari ya wahano mo. A defo be bray and a walk on my muha, and so soon no muna and a year a defo. There were defo a home whom I do muya germano, a home whom I mumu chantro, a nitty hair, or better about to a barber tree. A defo solia we see say, defo solia we see say. Eh, Prophet Abraham Lawrence Moko say, young kind chelagan a defo say, young coupon yen padasa new. Na nkupon, wanyi ni pada seni ni wadi atro. Na nkupon, wanyi ni pada seni ni wasi sana adwen. Na wose eno wanyi se wye difo. Nesu yi nkupon difo ampa. Ube tumi antane de nkupon aka. Wasi se ne difo nmu bi ekasa hai. Nesu sumu no. Na eye se yi na madane no ma ye ni se yi. Wasi yi nkanche se difo ni yina se mwye atrofo. Mwye nadafo. Nye nkupon aka wuni pada seni wane wanyi. Wose eno se yi. Sa wakase minyanko pwa kanu beti ma ase sana na aso beti ma dane no. Munyayi nko mtura na mwose sheno. Munkane nyanko pwa ka. Munkane nyanko pwa se. Munkane nyanko pwa yi achire mo. Na munyayi sa mwode mo pena mo dada ni pebi mo. Mwode mo pena mo dada ni pagbi no. Ose wande wakachire mo plen enye plen fa. Se eye JDM. John Domain Mahama eni endi sa mwenyuku no. Eni du 7 Dezemba. Ya beto bandi ya mawo. Muna ni 9th December. Ya declare se wo muna yi winners. Ana ya declare JDM so ni yi winna. Na 7th January 2025. Ya dinesi su se gana man penyini. Wasi upe umpu. Ya sana waho. Ni nyanko pon akano. Ni nyanko pon akano. 
ni pada se ni bere ni ho di fo bere ni ho a wo beti mi asesa no mu nyankom se tro na mo sese sese no na mo ni nyankopon akan emlem into man gana se no man gana esi ko intimu na mama ne kwasa na essence o man ne nye ni nyankopon eji do beti ma boa gana ono ni jdm aha e lo be for radio mu mi nko ti prophet abraham lawrence maruko maybe you might use the days of jona be remember when god sent jona to declare in the city of navy take note of this the kids announced every, all of them they change their attitude they change their doing behavior everything now our leaders are they change they change the character so there's no way you people are saying god is changing the things the rain is a lie is god out of confusion said yes to this and said no to this now let's see this NIV version let's see this numbers 23 19 god is not a human that he should lie not a human being that he should change his mind. Does he speak and then not act? Does he promise and not fulfill? Where have you got those things from? Because you people think we are ignorant of things of spirit in this. So these are changing the realm. I can see this changing. If somebody said the things are no, it's changing it because you want to be in, the, in between. Everybody want to be in between. Oh my God. Oh my God. You want to be in between. If this were hard, you didn't have said that things are changing the rain. This why God did, did not speak to you. God did, did not speak to you. God did, did not speak to you. Think about this nation. Think about this nation. What am I trying to say here? If you, somebody physically, maybe spiritually might not be like that, but physically, maybe you are, you are a man of God, you are a prophet, you are a man of, maybe spiritually you are not a man of God. Spiritually, maybe you are not a prophet. Now, physically, everybody is saying you are a man of God, a man of God. If you tell this man, oh, you win, you win. And then suddenly, it doesn't go like that. What is do? He will get angry and do what he is supposed not to do. Because you did not tell him that he's not going to win. You tell him he's going to win. So that is that will be his mind. So know that we men of God, we are trying to create confusion in this nation. We men of God, we are trying to create chaos in this nation. The judgment of God is coming. It's coming. All those things we are running after. Vanity upon vanity. Vanity upon vanity. There's a man in the Bible which all of us know. He said, ah, what do I only need again? Oh, I have this, I have that. I have... Let me rest, let me sleep. God said, you fool, I'll take your soul. All those words, why are they? Why are they? Why are they? The power belongs to God. All of us, we are in his palm. Don't try to create a confusion. War. We so-called men of God. Spiritual people. We should be careful. We should be careful. You per se can belong to Satan, but this nation belongs to God. You particular per se, you can belong to Satan, but the nation belongs to God. Almighty, I am that I am. So be careful. All of us should be careful. I'm included. You can yes. You can yes. Be vigilant now. Somebody can be a prophet today. He might not be a prophet tomorrow. Somebody might not be a prophet today. He, he might be a prophet tomorrow. Take the scenario. Somebody might be a prophet today, but tomorrow is no longer a prophet. The grace has departed. Somebody might not have that grace as a prophet today, but tomorrow is a prophet. So be, be smart enough. Be smart now. Depend on God, not we. Remember, if God said this, Forget God said this. Finish. You are looking, you are, you are, you are after worldly things, money. That is why you want to be in between. What did I say? I said that is changing the rain. <laughs> that is changing the rain. That is the, because you are you are checking media. 
You are taking media what is happening. You are taking outside what is happening. Not the voice of God. Shame unto us. Shame unto us. Shame unto us. May God have mercy on us and have mercy on this nation. I believe we, the prophet of this nation, is better for us to be telling our leaders the truth. Don't say, I belong to MPP. So let me prophesy to MPP to be happy. Don't say, I belong to NDC. Let me prophesy to NDC for them to be happy. Rather, tell them the truth. Let them cry today and laugh tomorrow. Think about the innocent people in this nation. I can say vividly some of the prophecies some people are giving. I can say it's not a prophecy that's from God. Rather, let us sit down and have our meeting. What do you what is the way out? What is the plan? This, oh, this plan is good. We are going to win. We will succeed. Then let me. I came out and said, I'm prophesying. Please and please. Please and please, God has sent us to quench a fire in the nation, not to let a fire burn up. If I'm a prophet of the nation, there's no way I will say, because you are my wife, you are my son. Because of that, you will not leave your party to opposition. We are talking about nation. We are not talking about son. We are not talking about friend. We are not talking about family. We are talking about nation. We are talking about nation. What do we think we are doing? Please and please, you can joke with your life. Don't joke with the nation. You and I will live. The Ghana is still a Ghana. Behave as a prophet. Behave as a prophet of nation. Behave as a prophet of nation. But what I'll tell you, this is what I saw. Yeah, Mahama. God has already chosen him. God has already chosen him. It's clear there. It's clear. God has told me plainly that he has to care Mahama. Thinking about what the Bible is saying here. If the Spirit of God has departed from you, a lying spirit can speak to you to tell us. Remember, when a lying spirit came to those 400 prophets, it doesn't brought profit to the, 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 the nation. It doesn't brought a profit, rather disaster. Please and please, you can joke with your life. Don't joke with the nation. At times, people are speaking especially this time, if you study what they are saying as if they are winning this election is already in their hand. If somebody is depending on God, when that person is speaking, you know. But they are speaking as if they have other alternative beside the God all of us are calling. Please and please, please and please, think about the innocent people in this nation. Yeah. Yeah. Mahama, God has already chosen him. God has already chosen him. I'm saying it again. This is what I have seen. This is what I have seen. What do you think we are doing? We give somebody the opportunity to drive us for eight solid years. Eight solid years, you couldn't drive us. Now you are saying that, hey, youth, don't go anywhere, don't go anywhere. Ah, apart from this prophecy. No, this prophecy is wrong. Don't go, don't travel. These seven years, this nation is going to be. No, that is your, that's your wisdom. That is your calculated, calculated prophecy. That is, I did not see that prophecy is a fraud that is coming from God. If you are telling that, yeah, that is the dream you have. No, that dream is not from God. 
from the pit of hell. Please, let us go by the scripture. As long as we still we believe in God, let's go by the word of God. The Bible said, there's no way a servant will be greater than his master. If we give this nation to the master to drive us, he couldn't. Is the servant is going to drive us for that seven years and we see change? No, don't deceive us. Don't deceive us. There's a challenge all over the world. Yes. But we are looking for the one God has chosen. So Mahama is the one God has chosen. And then he'll be there. If somebody like, you should go all over the sister region, whatever direction you want to do, do it. We believe in the Holy Spirit. We believe in God. We believe in God. So we should stop deceiving people. Uh, there's no way a servant, once again, a servant cannot be greater than his master. Let, let's see something. We can get it, John, John 13, John 13, uh, John chapter 13, reading from 16. Most assuredly, I say to you, a servant is not greater than his master. A servant can never be greater than his master. That's the word of God. So don't deceive us. Don't deceive us. This time is not your time. Baunya, go back to the drawing board. Your, your master couldn't drive us. And then God said, no. Mahama is coming to lead us. Remember, when King Saul was not ruling well in Israel, remember, God packed him and go and pick a shepherd boy. A shepherd boy and change the story of Israel. No. Servant can never be greater than his master. I'm saying God has prepared the seat down for Muhammad. Whether somebody like it or not. As the Bible says, Second King, God has used Elisha alone. When the whole Syria stood against him, God used Elisha to silence them. The Bible said, all nations surrounded us, but the Lord will deliver us from them. What I'm saying, if this will bring me, try it, God will deliver me. Once again, servant is not greater than his master. At times, we are looking at this anger, that no, this is the way, this is the way, this is the way, this is the way. Before you realize, God has passed this side to silence you. That's what's going to happen to this nation. God knows what he's going to do to silence what is happening. Man can never fight for Mahama. Man can only pray for Mahama. But the battle <laughs> is for the Lord. The battle is for the Lord. <laughs> The battle is for the Lord. Yes. Everybody is calling the same Lord. Lord, 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 Lord. But those who are calling him faithfully, he knows them. Yes. The Bible said, not all. Say, Lord, 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 Lord. Shall make heaven. Those who are calling him genuinely. So now, we are in court now. I believe God who judge this case in the favor of Muhammad. We shouldn't create a confusion, create war, chaos in this nation. If you think you have a passport, you think you have a money, you think that's why you are behaving like that, think about the innocent people. At times, the poor people, we don't regard God love them more than you. The people we think they're in a wheelchair. They don't have a food to eat today. They don't. At times, God loved them so much. So we shouldn't do anything to create a confusion in this country. Say, after the voting, they will declare, this time, after they declare, thousand people will come, 
to straight and the following day. What the, you calculate all this? What those thousand people who will come to the streets? What is it going to happen to them before next time they will not come? Following day they will not come. That means you plan something that you are going to do to them. That's why they will not come again. Please and please let our prophecy come from God, not the pit of hell. I'm not judging your prophecy. But remember, remember, if you and somebody are in the same farm, that person is no longer a lema. He know what he know. So please and please, we should stop creating confusion, chaos in this country. God has called us for a purpose, to assist them. If, if a president, a king, is not going the direction God wants him to go, warn him, tell him, let that king cry. Or let that king jail you. The more they hate you, the more they are punishing you, the more the love of God is upon you. Please and please, we should stop that. Everybody is crying for this nation. Everybody is crying, this nation, this nation. You are putting yourself in the position of God. Please and please, we should stop deceiving the people in this nation. Mahama, the seat is there waiting for you, bro. I'm telling you this. Those people, they are trying to plant fear in the life of Ghanaians. And you, Mahama, refuse to fear. Believe God. My God does not fail. That is the God of the Bible. The God of the Bible does not fail. I am that I am. The beginning and the end. God of Abraham, Isaac, Jacob. That is the God of heaven, earth, and see everything in them. The God of all flesh does not fail. Not everybody that locates that God. Not everybody locate that God. Unless you look for him before you find him. Yes. Fear not. Let the whole nation give a prophecy that Baumia will win. Let the whole nation give a prophecy. Believe your God. Don't believe anybody. Believe your God. That day, the angels of God will take control. Former President Mahama, those prophets, with their prophecies, they are trying to plant, to put fear in you and Ghanaians. Refuse to fear. Believe the God who have created you. The God that have put brief in you. Said that sit there is for you. You are going to sit down. The anger everybody seeing, God is going to change, turn things around. It will shock everybody. Mahama, sit down. Mahama, fear not. Mahama, be courageous. This is what God has revealed to me. When you get there, everything will be clear. Move forward. Move forward. Move forward. I keep on saying it. Yes, we can prophesy from the throne of grace, God. Somebody can prophesy from the source of darkness. Believe. God has chosen you. God has chosen you. Believe. What I want from Ghanaians what I want from Ghanaians, place and place is this. Let all of us spiritually, spiritually, let all of us trust the God of heaven. Yes, I trust God, Jesus. I don't care whatever you, you trust. Is it devil? <laughs> is, it that, is it that stupid Satan? You are free to trust him. No problem. Then we see then we see who God has spoken through. Mahama. <laughs> Mahama, fear not. The prophecies are coming out that <laughs> you faint. Prophecies are coming out that 
your vice will die. Fear not. By the grace of God, you will not fall sick. Your vice will not die. If something like that, I believe the God who has spoken through me will use me to deliver you. Will use me to heal you. Once again, the God who has spoken through me will use me to heal you. The Bible said, is anything too hard for the Lord to do? The Bible said, no. The Bible said, when the children of Israel were going through hardship, challenges, difficulties, they cried to God. God have heard their cry and answered them. God have heard the cry of Ghanaians. That's why he's choosing you. God will send his angels to fight the battle for you. You and I need to pray. Finish. This is what I have seen. I'm not saying it now. It's our YouTube and Facebook page. You can go and check. Let's think about all this. Don't prophesy to me because you are seeing my pocket. No. Prophesy for the people to have their freedom. What am I trying to say? I am also crying for this nation. For our motherland. I mean Ghana. I'm crying. I'm not against what you are saying. I'm just trying to advise Daniel. I'm trying. If you are calling yourself a spiritual person, a man of God, a woman of God, please tell your people the truth. Let them cry today and laugh tomorrow. Let us enjoy the peace God has given to us in this nation. The blessing, the peace we are enjoying in this nation, we have to continue enjoying it. But once again, something is going to happen. Shortly, because shortly something is going to happen and shock the whole nation. After that, everything. These are the things God has told me. It's going to happen. If it did not happen, then expect something dangerous. If they are saying they are going to do everything to come to power, then their dependence is not from God. But remember, everything can fail man. God does not fail. So prophets, apostles, pastors, teachers, evangelists, let us try and tell our leaders the truth. The God is